<laughs> so it's Pride Month, and you won't be able to not know that. You won't be able to not know that. Um, it's Pride Month again. As you know, we got in trouble by YouTube. I guess maybe it was last Pride. This show's been around, I think, yeah. a year yeah. now. We've, we're a year no, old. No, it wasn't last Pride. It was, was it? I think I was talking about Gay Pride Parade, and I said maybe we should put the Gay Pride Parade yeah, yeah. at night. Mm -hmm. um, just because I work during the day and I want to go. Is that better, YouTube? Or whoever's flagging it? I want to go. No, you said something about explaining I it. know, but don't say it. <laughs> don't say the joke. Don't say the innocuous joke that they took down and then put the episode back up. Um, but it is the Gay Pride Parade. And so um, we're about to see a lot of flags, dog. A lot of flags, a lot of rainbow flags. I think the military, the Marine Corps got in it and they did rainbow bullets in a helmet. <laughs> <laughs> These bullets are diverse. These bullets, this murder. If I'm going to get murdered during gay pride, I want to be be from accepting open-minded bullets. Yeah. Those I don't want to get I don't want to get killed by Republican bullets. Those bullets only hit people that have unironed shirts. Yeah. I want the bullet when it hits me to go, "Yes!" I want it when it screeches and goes through the air. It's more of a S <laughs> more of a snake sound yeah yeah the bullet goes through you playing celine dion yeah so it is gay pride month um it is this month where if you're gay have pride um as the world gets more accepting uh maybe the month will turn into uh, what is up with these month things why don't we just celebrate gay pride all year no nah, how about black history is just history june is appropriate though because the weather comes out and Acts the way it actually wants to act. Instead they, of being all dark. Yeah, and, you know. I'd yeah, but you know what? I'd rather Gay Pride was in January so it would be clothed. Now we're going to get taken <laughs> down. <laughs> I just think it would be better. It would just be... I don't know, dog. I mean, and I don't mean that. You see, now that sounds like I'm saying, you know, but that's not it. If there was a bunch of naked straight guys marching, I'd be like, can we put some clothes on? No, nah, bro. I'm walking with my family. No, bro. <laughs> Can't do that. It's not about not about not accepting gays. It's about, you know what I mean? My right in a public place to not see the inside of your colon. That's all I'm saying. Straight, gay, or other. It's about freedom for them. You can't have it in January because then they're just going to have mittens on with an anus crocheted on it. <laughs> But it is gay, gay Pride Month, so it is time to come out of the closet if you're in. Mm -hmm. This is the time, dog. You got the support of us, okay? Gay Pride. So June is, is Pride Month. Yeah. When's the parade? Are we going? We can go. We can document it. Let's go. We should get a float, long day's float. Get a long day's float and just go in there. Do you think Gay Pride is kind of like uh, the New Year resolution for working out? Where like January first comes, people go, I'm gonna work out and by the end for of the For the gonna... gay pride parade. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of people like, Yeah, I'm gonna go gay at the end of the month. They're heterosexual. Yeah. 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 yeah they get... I mean, you gotta give it to these dudes, man. Gay guys are healthy. They're just in shape, man. They're just in shape. Just lets you know when you're trying to when you're trying to impress other dudes. Dudes are visual. Mm -hmm. Dudes are visual. A woman will fuck a gay guy. I'll fuck a fat guy before a gay guy will. Because of his heart. Unless he's into that, which is a subset. But mostly gay, gay guys are in shape. Gay pride is fun, dog. Gays are great. One of the best things that happened to civilization is the acceptance of gays. Because they just, you know... If you got a gay pride parade, you know your country's a good place to be. It's an indication that things are good. You go to a neighborhood, you see gays, you're in a great place. I was in Newport, Rhode Island. Shout out to the Rhode Island Comedy Festival. Thank you for having me. I saw gays. Mm. Guess what's nice? Newport. Nobody goes to Afghanistan and sees a gay muffin shop. <laughs> There's a reason for that because it's a shithole. If there's a place where gays aren't rolling around, it, you're probably in a, a place that's not tourist friendly. It's not a place people want to go to and spend their tourist dollars. Okay, you go to Mykonos, you're going to see some guys. You're going to see a little bit of that. 
You're going to see some of that action. You're going to see some of that action. You're going to see. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way to be straight. There's no way to be straight and dance palms up. It's just not possible. It's not possible. It is not possible to make this straight. Because even if I'm listening to a song, if my palms are out, yeah, you know, and you can't do this without doing that. So there's just, you're going to go to Mykonos, you're going to see that, you know you're in a highly trafficked tourist attraction. People mm -hmm. want to go, people want to be there, people are having a good time. You see a lot of guys dancing like Iron Man flies? Yeah. It's going to be a lot of gays. Yeah, I mean, gays are happy. It's crazy to think that it was illegal. It was in, in the United States. Yeah. And like up until what the fifties or the sixties, it was actually illegal. Yeah, it was. It's, uh, it's weird. Those types of things are that. That's what you call good progress, man. So happy gay pride to all the gays out there. You guys are fun. The only people who are who are threatened by gay people. Here we go. This is just a naked dude. The only people who are threatened by gays are people who are hiding something. People mm -hmm. who uh, you know. Some comedian said it. I can't remember, but he said, "Yeah, is it because it was actually." Guy's brilliant, man. Sasha Baron Cohen. He goes like something about like secret. Are you wondering? Are the, because they're secretly delicious. Dicks are secretly <laughs> delicious. <laughs> That's really what it is. Otherwise, the hate just doesn't make sense. Mm. Otherwise, why would you care so much? You know, why would you care so much? Why does it? Why does it bother you so much? Now, here's the truth. I went to uh, you know my brother's party, and uh, his birthday party, and all his friends were gay. Now, here's the, here's the honest truth. Not my scene. Not my scene, mm -hmm. okay? They're gay. They're having a blast. They're laying on each other on the couch. When they get drunk, gay guys, they look at you and they have a look. And it's like, I, I like getting hit on by guys. or I don't mind that, but it's just kind of like, it's not my scene. I'm not, you know, I'm like, I, 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 it's not my scene. Mm -hmm. It's just not my scene. It's LARPing. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. just not something like, I, I want to, I, I don't want, I didn't want to stay a long time because it's not my scene. Cause I know the party's going to kick up a couple notches. <laughs> and it's just, you know, when you're straight guys are fucking, we're just concerned. You know, we like to sit against walls, we like to stand against <laughs> walls with arms closed. You know, if girls are there, we still are closed. You know, and we fucking, we do different things. It's a different scene. And that's fine. Mm -hmm. That's a fine thing. You know, they were having a little, you know, it was like, it was like a gay party happening in one room. And then you could see like all the family members kind of were in another room. And it wasn't because we didn't know the other guys. It was just, they were being too gay. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a bad thing. It's just like, if you're at a party and people are talking about swimming. And you're like, I don't like that sport. You're going to gravitate to the sports that you like. Yeah, well, you walked into that party. People thought you were a bouncer. <laughs> no, yeah, people, there's no mistaking a straight guy if you're gay. They know. They got gator. They can see you walk in. They're like, this guy doesn't care about his appearance. This guy's mother-in-law cuts his hair. You know, it's just not, there's a different level to it. Yeah, they Gay guys, they, they take fashion. They take things to, they, they just, everything is nice. That's why when you go, you know, to a neighborhood and you see a couple lesbians walking around, Buy a house. That neighborhood's about to get gentrified, my friend. Everyone's going to want to live there. Like I've said before, lesbians are the Marines of gentrification. They come in first. You know, they deal with all the rough elements of the neighborhood. They defend their businesses with bats and short haircuts. <laughs> and then the gays come. Because the lesbians are tougher than the gays, generally. The lesbians fucking are ready to brawl, dog. Yeah. They get in there first. They're the Marines, the toughest ones. And then the Navy shows up. You know, gay guys like it's safe. Let's open up. Let's up, let's open a frame store for people who want to put their paintings in frames. You remember Ginger's Bar on Fifth Avenue? That was the first one down there That's in right. Park Slope. Ginger's Bar it was like a lesbian bar, and it was before gentrification. Yeah, we and it was just an outpost. You just saw it. It's like an outpost. It's yeah. like oh, the lesbians are here. This part is is probably going to start getting more expensive. It was the hood, and then Ginger's Bar. Mm. Yeah. And Ginger wasn't a lady. <laughs> Ginger wasn't a lady in the traditional sense. She had the, she had the anatomy of one, but she also had the attitude of one of your boys. You could call Ginger up and be like, what the fuck? Is, did you see that foul? Bullshit. These refs are bullshit. And Ginger would say, tell me about it. The on the phone sounded like Larry King. Yeah. So happy Pride Month to all, 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 all my gays out there. You know? It's a fun time. It's great. It's beautiful. 
glad we live in a world where it's becoming, it's becoming more accepted. And hopefully it gets to a point where it's like so normal and accepted and such a thing of the past that we can have an honest conversation about maybe putting some more clothes on during the parade. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Anyway, 